Hello, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. This card I used a die that I've had for a few years. It's part of a set, there's two of them. This one's just a um, yeah, it's snowflakes. But this one we're going to use is a deer with some snowflakes around it. You can't see it. There. And this is the bit that cuts out. So today we're going to use that. The snowflakes, I've already cut them out. These were what was left over from my um, Christmas tree where I cut out hundreds of snowflakes and so I thought I'd use them up on this card. The sentiment comes from um, Star of Light and I just used that Merry Christmas there. Um, the paper, alright let's go into what you need. You need a card base, I'm using Mary Marla. It is 11 and 3 quarters by 4 and 1 eighth, scored at 5 and 7 eighths, and folded in half and burnished. I've got a piece of white cardstock at 5 and 5 eighths by 3 and 7 eighths. I've actually got two of these, one for the inside. I have a piece of the paper, which you would have seen in a card I've already done. And I've reversed it, and I've got this beautiful dark red paper with a black swirl. So I'm using that. Uh, I've got a scrap for the sentiment, and I've also got a piece of I don't need that white for the plain background, and a piece of silver foil for the outline this the deer so to get started we need the scraps I'll do the sentiment afterwards that's for the inside which I'll do afterwards did I stamp inside yes a little Christmas spirit brightens all the world so we'll stamp that inside afterwards but first we need to do some cutting out so let's get the big shot up cutting plate and we're going to cut out the main one first just cut out that first our main bit. Get rid of that, we don't need that. Now to cut out the silver bit we need the main bit and then we need to place this bit in there evenly. Is that done like that and put some tape on it so it stays put the cutting plate on 
and send it through. I am going to send it back. that off and take this out wiggle it out just got our silver bit right what I am going to do well, I never did it on the other one is I am going to run the plain bit through a snowflake embossing, pow embossing powder embossing folder so which is a cutter bug one and I am going to place that in there. Um, yeah, like that. Put that on. There we have snowflakes all over the the back of it. Just gives it an extra bit of dimensional dimension. If I have the snowflakes on, you can't see that, can you? There you are. So we finish with that. We finish with them. This off. Put these back in the wallet. So we have got our where's my silver one gone? Oh. And that will go on there like that. And all I did was glue that down. So I'll glue this on the uh, back in. I quick card this. I can see bits I haven't poked out. So. Need to poke them out. Just little bits uh, out. Uh, 
That's where the snowflakes are mainly. That one. That one and and of course the one on the deer which doesn't want to come out. And then we place that on there. bits of glue on it. So what I'm going to do is just go over it with a wet wipe and it takes off any of the glue that's on it. This needs dimensionals. That's small ones. do fine. Right. All we need to do is stick this card together. So with our paper. I love that colour. Stick this on white piece of card And that will go on there, so take the backings off. Shall stamp our um, sentiment and the inside of our card once I put this in. 
uh, the scraps, stamps, ink. I had to get ink on my fingers, didn't I? Right, first the sentiment. And what I'm going to do is stamp that just there. Fine, we'll cut that out in a minute. And then the inside. And we'll just pop that in the middle of the page and pray it straight. Right, and this we'll, we'll pop inside the card. Right, I don't know what we've got to do, stick these snowflakes on. Right, I'm going to put one there, one there, one under the end of the sentiment, one under that end, and a second one here. So we'll just, that's the wrong way. Just pop a little spot of glue on these and stick them down. Right, I'm going to stick that one there because this one's different. I should put them two down after I've done cut the sentiment up. Right. It's not, didn't stamp that very straight, so. Let's do it again and try and stamp it straight. That's better. It's going to go there. It still doesn't look straight. Third time lucky? What do you think? Going to straighten this end out first. 
before I lay this end. So it should have worked out the first time. Ow. Right, I am going to flag these, but this way, this one I did on a slant. I'm not that keen on that, so I am going to just flag these out. One. More rubbish. And that I'm going to put on dimensionals. over the bottom and with our two snowflakes pop some glue on them and just slide them under And do the same down there. And there you have it. That's today's card. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my cards, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. I hope you like it. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon. Don't forget the thumbs up.